U.S., thousands of women learn they have cervical cancer. I could be one less. One less statistic. One less. Because now there's Gardasil, the only vaccine that may help protect you from the four types of human papillomavirus that may cause 70% of cervical cancer. I want to be one less woman who will battle cervical cancer. One less. Like all vaccines, Gardasil may not fully protect everyone. The side effects include pain, swelling, itching and redness at the injection site, fever, nausea, or dizziness. Gardasil is not for women who are pregnant. Gardasil does not prevent all types of cervical cancer, so it is important to continue with routine cervical cancer screening. Gardasil will not treat cervical cancer. Ask your doctor about getting vaccinated with the only cervical cancer vaccine, Gardasil. 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 With Gardasil, you could be one less. I want to be one less, one less. <laughs> Collapsed after being given the cervical cancer vaccine Gardasil. Health authorities are urging parents to stay calm, insisting the drug, which is being offered to students in WA, is safe. Brooke Levi thought the Gardasil shot she had on Friday at Engadine High was going to protect her. But now she blames the cervical cancer vaccine for a bad reaction. I want to pass out and just throw up and just go to sleep. Brooke ended up at Sutherland Hospital. Two weeks ago, Melbourne student Natasha D'Souza also felt unwell after being vaccinated. I actually wasn't looking too good and I was looking a bit green in the face. And then I just basically collapsed about five minutes into class. Natasha says her arms and legs were paralysed and she couldn't speak. She wasn't the only girl to have the jab, then fall sick. Yeah, there were girls dropping like flies basically. Medical authorities have declared the reactions aren't linked to Gardasil. They've blamed fear of needles. The after effects are uh, very, very rarely serious and the benefits of the vaccination are very, very important. There's no reason to stop the vaccination program. The vaccines have been thoroughly tested uh, both in Australia and overseas and have been found to be extraordinarily safe. 70,000 Gardasil vaccinations have been administered since the drug's approval last year. Full protection against the virus that causes cervical cancer requires follow-up shots, but many girls aren't keen to chance it. I don't want to after going through this. Damien Smith, 7 News.